Florida from Monteria, Colombia, Mauricio Pastrana. 12 rounds of action. Uh, Tim Austin, who was an Olympic teammate of mine, uh, was for the title at 115 pounds. Good right hand from Marquez. Final seconds, round one. He threw a good two-punch combination there, but he needs to throw threes and fours. Marquez almost went a little south there with a the punch. Nice jab he flicked out there. In the center of the ring. They've been all over the place. I got a feeling this thing's going to have to heat up sooner or later. Yeah, Marquez needs to pound the box. Heading to round three here from Staples Center in Los Angeles. Alan Matt. Estrada coming in now. That's what we didn't see. Oh, good right hand for Marquez inside. On the body more. There it is. Good body shots. Double up. Marquez landing some accurate hard. There's the double up, triple up. Estrada manages to avoid there. Estrada going backwards now, though. The more that Pastrana slows down. We're still early in this thing. I guess the oh, team yes. is patient. Good right hand. What's up on the apron? Here we go. They got a water spot on the uh, canvas, I mean. which is never good. Somebody can get hurt. A lot of it coming off that stinging jab that Nacho Beresnan, one of the most famous trainers. Just came through easily. He's got to go back to that jab. And he ran into a, another jab there, Marquez. Down a little bit, but he's boring right in right now. Uh, he's got to work in the inside. He's a shorter fighter. It's a better round for final seconds, round four. Good right hand for Marquez. Have to go, put go. on if he can keep that up. Okay, together. That was a good shot. Good right? one, two there. One, yes. Two, yes. Salquez. Juan Manuel Marquez at 122. Mm -hmm. but not very really effective. Going to take a look at Marquez's nose. A little bit impatient around here. But uh, Pastrana continues to move. Oh, right hand, right at the last round. This is basically why he's uh, winning the fight. He's been very busy with his jab. Rafael looks like he wants to really get some stuff done. Pastrana burying in. Pretty good combination there for Pastrana. Collins when he gets in the inside. Yeah. And he should take advantage of that. You see, he just connected. I don't know. Marquez. But he might not have the strength. Oh, inside. And yeah, he needs to come back. Come back over to the, the top. other side, yes. yes. Come back over the top behind. Right. Great fighter from Phoenix, Arizona. You can tell he's the kind of fighter that doesn't like to have somebody that. Kilo de velocidad manejándome atrás. Creo que ahora es diferente y espero hacerlo. I wanted to make sure that. Oh, good right hand. Now Pastrana's pouring in. to see what happens. He's got nothing to lose. I mean, he, should, he needs to take the fight to Marquez if he does better. Good right hand for Marquez. From 12. Knocked down. Knocked out. I think if he really puts his... No, Pastrana's... That was a right hand. Yeah, back in the corner. <laughs> Go to round eight here. 69-64 for... Rafael Marquez. I should. Estrada pretty good. On I think that Marquez will like it just fine. Good combination inside. Good uppercut. Oh. Left hand. Back. Good right hand. Close. Marquez. He knows he's got him hurt. Yeah. I combination inside. Estrada to an end. Has been picking him apart like a surgeon. Oh, if he just puts a body, the body shot, then the body shot. He was complaining about it. He didn't like him. Marquez over the top of the right. Marquez. Right hand, left hand combination. Final seconds, round eight. The line here at Staples Center in Los Angeles. 79, 73. Front tear from some of the jabs he's absorbed tonight. Oh, he's and it hurts your hands yes. sometimes when you hit. I had that problem before. Uh... Very well conditioned fighter. I don't know, Marquez this round. But he's doing enough. He's keeping busy with the jab. Breather in the last round. Here we go, <laughs> round 10. IBF Bantamweight Championship. Letting it all out here. Number 10, both fighters are tired. Especially Pastrana. Makes a miss. I'll tell you what, when you're as tired as Pastrana is and you miss punches like that, it's, it even gets you more tired. He'll put Pastrana down. He'll hurt him. Final seconds, round 10. 
Championship and Browns here. I'm surprised that Nacho didn't tell him to go to the body a little bit more because that's yeah. when he really stopped. Oh, threw one, but wasn't very effective. He needs to come back on the other side. Back from strong a little bit, maybe from exhaustion. I don't know. You know, it just it's, at this point you could pound the body. I, I assure you, I know that that Pastrana is. Well, let's see what happens. Yeah, maybe he's been saving himself for this round. This could be. He's a knockout to win the fight. It's obvious. And Pastrana's throwing like a crazy man. It's gonna be a busy 12th round. Here we go. Yeah, he's got the heart of a champion. I know that much. Good left hook. Oh, that, that I hurt him. Marquez. <laughs> He's not throwing anything here. Here he comes, boring in, and he eats a couple. IBF Bantamweight Championship. Let's just hope they don't have it for Pastrana. We might see it right here. Win the fight. Good right hand. Nunez trying to finish up in grand style. That's it. Fight for Rafael Marquez in his first title defense. Rafael. 